Chica, perdón que te sal... Celebrities calling it quits is old news now. However, infidelity can be a painful experience for those who invest themselves in long-term relationships. Well, that might be the case with Shakira, as Shakira has seemingly made a thinly veiled swipe at her ex, Gerard Piquet, and his new girlfriend in her latest song. Is Shakira finally coming out with her long-awaited revenge on the now-retired soccer player? You might have forgotten, but the Waka Waka hitmaker and the World Cup winning defender were one of the most popular celebrity couples and everyone loved seeing them together. Now that the 12 years love is gone, Shakira finally left her moved on facade and decided to come back as a living nightmare for Gerard. Will Shakira keep mocking her ex for cheating on her? Or Gerard finally loses his cool over this matter? Let's find out. Recently, the Colombian singer has collaborated with producer Bizrap on a brand new track, Shakira Bizrap Music Sessions 53. As soon as the song was relieved, fans were thrilled to see it delivered exactly what was anticipated. Over an electric beat, Shakira reminds people of the superstar she is. During the song, it looks like the Colombian superstar addresses her breakup from the soccer player Gerard Piquet. As we see Shakira saying, I'm too big for you, in what appears to be a dig at her ex Gerard and his new girlfriend Clara Chia Marty. The pop star belts out, I'm too big for you, that's why you're with someone just like you, in an apparent relationship to Gerard's new romance. She clearly mocks her ex that he wasn't worthy of her and eventually he got what he actually deserves. She continued singing, This is for me to mortify you, chew and swallow so it doesn't sting. I won't get back with you. Not if you cry, not if you beg me. It shows how she never wants to go back to a person who abandoned her and their children. One of the most biting lines were, It's clear that it's not my fault if they criticize you. I just make music. Sorry if it splashes you. She pauses at the end, emphasizing PK, a clear point at her ex. Well, it's evident that she is only doing what she can do best, which is writing songs and singing them. Now, it's not her fault if her music paints what her cheater boyfriend has done to her. On the other hand, the pop star doesn't want to make Gerard's new love interest feel left out, so she explicitly focuses on the most striking factor of this new blooming love affair, which is undoubtedly PK's new partner age. Shakira referenced Claire Chia's age in her new song, as she says, She is worth two of 22 years old. That verse continues with two unflattering comparisons that suggest she believed PK has downgraded in his new relationship. She continued the comparison saying, You change a Ferrari for a Twingo. You changed a Rolex for a Casio. Not only that, Shakira also goes on to describe Clara Chia as my supposed replacement. It wasn't your fault or mine. It was Monotony's fault. I never said anything, but it hurt me. I knew this would happen. Suddenly, you were no longer the same. You left me because of your narcissism. You forgot what one day we were. <laughs> Ouch! Well, it's not the first time Shakira has seemingly shaded Gerard in her music after making reference to a necessary split with an ex who cheated on her in her former song, Monotonia. This song also touched more on the breakup side, showing Shakira dejectedly walking through the streets with a hole in her chest, symbolizing her heartbreak while people around her trampled on her heart. In her song, she alludes to the relationship being over before it ended, singing, It's a necessary goodbye. What used to be incredible became routine. Your lips don't taste of anything to me. Now it's the complete opposite. After the breakup of the three-time Grammy winner, her songs always represent what she truly feels about her now broken relationship. How they were destined to be separated because they weren't meant to be together anymore. Appearing to reference the end of her relationship, she says, You left me because of your narcissism. You forgot what you used to be. Distant with your attitude and that filled me with worry. You didn't even give half. I know I gave more than you. Looks like it's true that she already gave more than he ever gave her. It was as if he never fully invested himself in their relationship. In her big hit Te Felicito, the first one since their breakup, the Colombian clearly hinted at her pain. To complete you, I broke into pieces. I was warned, but I didn't listen. I realized that yours is false. It was the drop that overflowed the glass. Don't tell me you're sorry. That seems sincere, but I know you well, and I know you lie. 
Before Monotonia, Shakira dropped Te Felicito, the song which came out in April last year, hit number one on Billboard's Latin Airplay chart. You might not know, but Te Felicito refers to how Shakira actually feels after breaking up with her ex. Her super hit song says, In order to complete you, I broke into pieces. They warned me, but I didn't listen. Don't tell me your story. That seems sincere, but I know you well, and I know you lie. Her breakup with Gerard completely broke her at one point, and seems like the hurt that she felt from his betrayal will never heal. She will never believe in anyone's love lies, and she will never invest in people who don't value her anymore. While Shakira never confirms that her songs are actually about her ex, still, she explains the significance of her song's lyrics that always represent what she actually feels. That's what she says about her songs. She says, I can only say that either consciously or subconsciously Consciously, everything I feel, everything I go through is reflected in the lyrics I write, in the videos I make. When the glove fits, it fits. In June 2022, the Colombian pop star and retired soccer player officially called it quits after spending 12 years together. They have two sons, Milan and Sasha. The official statements by the singer states, we regret to inform that we are separating. For the well-being of our children, who are our highest priority, we request respect for our privacy. Thank you for your understanding. Soon after their separation, Gerard went public with his new girlfriend and co-worker, Clara Chia Marty. They appear to be spotted many times on different occasions as they don't need to hide their love affair from anyone anymore. At New Year, Shakira seems to take a swipe at her ex again with her post about betrayal and heartache. Starting the new year off on a positive note, she wrote, even if our wounds are still open in this new year, time has surgeon's hands. Even if someone has betrayed us, we must continue to trust others. She continued, when faced with contempt, continue to know your worth because there are more good people than indecent ones, more people with empathy than indifference. The ones who leave are fewer than the many who stay by our side. Our tears are not in vain. They water the soil our future will spring from and make us more human so that even while suffering heartache, we can continue to love Shaq. Well, this message comes just months after her and the soccer star's official separation. Um, don't feel joke as uh, jugant un bon futbol, uh, futbol que planteja el Julen que ja coneixem de la selecció i que també ens va anar durant el temps que el vam tenir, així que espero un equip molt ben treballat, un equip que vulgui tenir molt la pilota. After being mum on the matter for so long, PK finally decided to tell his side of the story. Well, looks like Gerard really was fed up from her long last relationship with Shakira. After 12 years with the same person, he doesn't have the same feelings, or might I add, doesn't feel any spark for her anymore. In his eyes, the stunning singer was getting old and couldn't keep up with his expectations anymore. So he just replaced her with his now 22 year old girlfriend. Well, Gerard does have his pathetic reasons to cheat on Shakira, but as you see, it's not completely her fault. He completely ignores her even when she was there to congratulate him on his victory. Seems like he never really appreciated her, and it was Shakira who was giving her all in that long-lost relationship. Maybe it's a good thing that they split up. All we can say now is that Gerard was just looking for an opportunity to get rid of Shakira as he was bored of her and wanted to replace an old toy with a young and new one. So it's better for Shakira to keep her spirit high and be happy as she finally gets rid of a person who actually doesn't deserve her. Well, the 35-year-old professional athlete said goodbye to soccer. Shakira is still hard at work, making new music following their split. Access Hollywood spoke to the Whenever Wherever songstress back in May with her Dancing With Myself co-judge, Nick Jonas. And she teased her upcoming album, plus revealed if she would ever collab with the Jealous singer at his Vegas residency. Even if PK has retired now, Shakira is on her way to releasing some new songs. She planned to get back on track while still giving priority to her responsibilities as a parent and pay heed to her son's needs. Nonetheless, fans are anticipating to listen to many great songs by Shakira this year. Not only that, fans are also siding with Shakira on this matter, leaving Gerard with no support at all. One of them commented, He is a fool. He had the perfect girl, great family, successful career, as a legend with no controversy, and he threw it away. Well, he was truly a fool to cheat on a woman like Shakira. 
one of her supporters said, such a beautiful woman, singer, smart, and a good mother she is. Only a foolish guy would leave Shakira. Another added, PK, you're nothing without Shakira. That's it for today, folks. Until next time, goodbye.